and for thanks i'll start over so i think the only thing on the agenda today is to talk about uh the release so um we want to do a release at the beginning of june this is so we can have a base to build off of for the tutorial at isca and the um boot camp um which is at the end of june and end of july respectively um so if we're going to do a release at the beginning of june so i think june 3rd is here i'll share um share this um oops, sorry give me one second okay um so the plan is to release on june 3rd so that means we need to create the staging branch on monday may 20th which is a little bit more than a week um, from now uh it would be okay if we pushed this that would not be the end of the world but um just to give some the, we, we need some kind of deadline um okay so these are what we have on our milestones if other people have things that they want to put on the milestone for trying to complete um let us know and we can do that either now or asynchronously um so the testing support for 2404 that is mostly done um now that ubuntu 2404 is out we'll get that done um, in the next few days um this uh standard library improvements for pystats is on bobby and i think that's pretty close the multi-processing simulation class is also on bobby and pretty close there should be a final PR for these out within the next couple of days for review. Um, and then same for uh, using objects for exit events. Um, that should also be done very soon. Is this PR up to date, Bobby? Just out of curiosity. Uh, which, sorry, which, uh, which, uh, which one the uh, modified? Uh, oh, sorry, this is an issue, not a PR. Yeah, e so a PR for this should be available soon. Yeah. There is a PR. Maybe. Um, okay, so that's on us. Um, these are things that we're working on. Cling format. Um, this has been a thorn in our side for a long time. I think it's on Giacomo's plate right now. I don't know what the status is. We will reach out to him and try to figure that out. And then um, the vector tail mask policy dependencies. Um, I'm also not sure what the status of that is. Ivana or Herschel or Bobby, have you followed up on this lately? No. Okay, so we'll follow up on that as well. Um, so it looks like we're in an okay place uh, to get the release done in the next few weeks. Um, I don't know if there's anything else that other people want to discuss about the release today or anything else. Yeah, I have a bunch of things, but I mean, Mostly of just trying to get the resources updated because they're about two years old for the GPU stuff. Um, and I don't know if that's something I can do by myself. Right. It's probably not something you can do by yourself. Um, so, uh, yeah, that's a great question. So what is the status of that right now, Matt? Thanks for bringing that up. In terms of resources, I don't have any more PRs for the disk, at least and the docker image that we provide applications are a whole other question but so this disk image um have mm -hmm. we has it been built and posted on uh, and uploaded to um our google cloud bucket um no i I built it i don't know where this bucket is okay that's fine um can, is it feasible for us to rebuild it? Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, so in that case, Herschel, one of your tasks will be to rebuild this and post it and upload it to our Google Cloud bucket. Okay, yeah. Um, Ivana, will you put that as a task for the release? Um, 
So are there other resources um, other than this GPFS disk? Um, so when you build this, it will extract the kernel and that probably should also be a resource. Yep, sounds good. And then for, there's a Docker image we provide to build the application. So you don't need to install GPU libraries on your host machine. Um, and I don't know if that's something I can do too, which is essentially updating the GHCR um, Gen 5 test. That's uh, I forget what the name of the Docker image is called, but it's like GPFS or something. Um, you probably, well, actually, you might have permission to do that, but I don't know how to do that. <laughs> okay. Uh, Bobby, the do you know how it does? Still open. Oh, really? Okay. Um, is there a PR for this somewhere here, or? Yeah, it's in the the uh, main repository. Oh, okay. So it's in like the util Docker. And all I did was just update the version number to six point one. I see it. So let me. Um... Okay, I'll add that there. And part of that will be um, that we will make sure that that gets pushed to GHCR. Okay, thanks. Yeah, no, thanks for bringing that up. Is there anything else um, related? Um, <laughs> I mean, I guess we don't have any like applications in the resources, but it's sort of, I'm, I'm trying to discuss with Matt Sinclair how to go around that. Okay, um, if you, Matt and I had a, a bit of a discussion about this yesterday as well. Um, so if you want to, uh, set up a meeting between the three of us. Um, I'm happy to help. And, you know, I, I'm also you know, willing to put some resources towards it. Um, Partial has been building new disk images and stuff. And so we've developed some expertise um, in this so we can help. Okay. Uh, I'm going to talk to him in like four hours and then I'll get back to you. Okay. Sounds great. Anybody else have anything that needs to be in for the release um, or that they want to discuss? Bobby, did you have anything else on your agenda? Uh, no, no, I just go through the milestones and that's pretty much it. Okay, cool. Well, in that case, we can and early. Okay, great. Thanks, everyone. Um, we will talk to you next month. Expect to see lots of emails about the release uh, between now and then. Thanks, everyone. Bye.